This is the hat guy. He is currently on a journey to collect every piece of headgear in the game of RuneScape to cover up his bald spot that he is all too ashamed of. There is currently 635 pieces of obtainable headgear in the game and he plans to collect them all. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the adventures of the hat guy. I just want to go ahead and buy this black longsword here just because any DPS upgrade is going to help for all the stuff I want to do and I can't be using the iron dagger for the rest of my life. So let's go ahead and sell that. So I want to start this episode off with some massive gains here. There's a couple masks in Diango's shop that I wanted to buy. Get the Mask of Truth, the Druidic Wreath. Those are two easy things. I also want to get a Chronicle, obviously, because... That's like one of the best ways to get around. Get some teleport cards here, just buy as much as I can. And I believe he also has a banana mat, or banana hat I can buy as well. Wait, do I buy it or do I just gotta talk to him? So for the, for the longest time, I actually didn't even know how to get this hat. And it just like appeared one day and like just everyone was just wearing these hats. And it was really, I think it was during leagues. And I saw him wearing it, I was like, where did they get these hats? And it wasn't until like, just like recently, whenever I was like looking up how, like where a lot of these hats were for free to play, that I realized that you just get it from Diango. And, well, I mean, hey man, a hat's a hat. So, let's, let's put these things on. We got the Mask of Balance. That thing is ugly. Oh my gosh. Druidic Wreath, not too shabby. Doesn't hide the bald spot though. Banana hat, that is a keeper though. I really like that hat. Alrighty. So I just realized I forgot to buy one of the hats. These, this horn helmet. There it is. Hornwood helm. Yep. I can't believe I almost missed this one. You guys would have roasted me for that. And this is like the best one too. Look at this, looking like a Chad straight out of the forest. All right, on to the next thing. So I want to start getting some quests done and what better way to start than the good old fashioned X marks a spot. I'm gonna have to do a lot of clue scrolls anyways. Might as well get started on this and a few other things along the way. But yep, just gotta talk to old Vios here, get his step and we will be on our way. They really made this quest way too easy. They didn't make you require any items. You just have to follow the device and just go straight to the dick spot. Honestly, it's really just a gimme quest. A free beginner clue is what I like to think. But let's go give this Vios and complete this quest. There it is. X marks the spot completed on the account. We have our first beginner clue. We also have this XP lamp, which we need to figure out what we want to put it into. I think the answer should be obvious. I think I think I gotta go with prayer on this one. Just kind of like stick to my guns on it. It's the hardest thing in free to play to train, in my opinion. Other than maybe rune crafting, but I don't really mind rune crafting. We'll take that level easy, and now we get started on this first step, Charlie the Tramp. I feel like I'm gonna get very used to him. Charlie, my boy, what do you got for me? What do you need? A leather body? Yeah, that's not too bad. Yeah, let's go, let's go get that for you real quick. Here's your leather body, sir. Thank you for the new clue. What is it? Charlie the Tramp again. Oh boy. What does he want this time? Piece of iron ore. Well, that might be a problem. So you see... I have the lowest level mining level you can possibly have. Iron ore takes 15. 
that is a very different number. So I'm going to have to go get that. So I will be back when I am done with that. Alright, before I get started mining, there's something I forgot. I need to get this. It's a nice, nice quick and easy hat. So, not too long ago, Jagex held a pride event where you can get one of these flower crowns. You can switch it to a bunch of different other crowns from one. Which, first of all, I think is really cool that they are showing their support and everything. But for me, this is nine free hats. And this is all of them right here. Hey, a white bean. Let's go. That's one step closer to being done with that quest. There is 15 mining. We finally have what we need. Get a piece of iron. I'm gonna go steal a rock from this guy real quick. Thank you very much. I don't even think he was actually mining. Yeah, he's doing something else. But yeah, let's go give this to old Charlie and be on to the next thing. Okay, Charlie, here's your piece of iron. Give me a casket, please. No, oh, another clue. What could this possibly be, though? Couldn't be anything too bad. Charlie the Tramp. Oh, boy. All right, Charlie. What do you want? Show me what you got for me now. Cook trout. Oh, boy. Well, looks like I know what I'm doing now. Just, just gotta do this the one time, and then I have it forever. Alrighty, let's go cook some trout. Freaky Forester, what you doing here, bud? You need some help with some pheasants? I got you, my guy. This will be the easiest hat of my life right here. I'm just saying, uh, take this, kill one three-tailed pheasant, bring it to you. Just really wish you'd give me that hat you got on your head there, bud. Alright, let's go and leave out the door. And what are we going to get? No! How unfortunate. And by the way, we switched to the leader hose on top. And we also have 20 fishing. We can now catch trout. We still need to go be able to cook trout, though. So let's go start working on that might be able to burn or burn through some of the uh, backstock fish i have and then go catch some trout and cook that up shouldn't be too bad all right got my cooking level up got some trout let's get some cooked trout up in here there's at least one successful there so that's good that means we get to at least progress who is this guy all right charlie i've done three steps for you now, the least you can do is give me this on the very first casket. That's all I ask, man. That's all I ask. Honestly, not worth my time at all. Alright, I'm here in Falador now. I want to try to just, like, I know that there's a bunch of imp spawns here, so I'm just going to keep going here until I either fall asleep or I get this bead. And I don't... I don't know how long that's going to take, but I'm only missing the black bead at this point. So I just need to just finish this up, grind it out, and be here until I get it. No! A duplicate red bead? Oh, that's so upsetting. Another red bead. Oh, hello. How's it going, Mr. Yusuf, old man? Wait, he just gives you stuff? What about the events? I want to I want to go do a mime show. Yellow B, come on. Give me everything except what I want to see. Oh, white B. We officially have a duplicate of every other type. All right, just give me that last bead now. There it is! We are done with the imps. No more do I have to kill you. Uh, we, we managed to get all four beads in this one little sitting here. And all the other beads before this didn't even matter. I can just go straight to the quest. All the four of them. 
right here. And even got another duplicate red in my inventory. We are donezo. So we've brought this man his beads back. And honestly, this quest for an early game Iron Man is honestly probably one of the most essential things to do. Magic experience starting off, you get the amulet of accuracy. There's really nothing bad about doing this quest. And it really, like if you get spooned on those beads, super quick too. So I definitely want to keep knocking out some quests. I'm going to go ahead and do Rune Mysteries and maybe a few others, but it kind of gets to that point when we get there. But let me just go ahead and grab this Air Talisman from old Duke Horatio and knock this out. And there is Rune Mysteries completed. Along the way, we've also completed Restless Ghosts. Got that out of the way. Easiest quest in the game, Dorg's Quest, completed. So I was told that this shop right here sold a very convenient hat. The Black Wizard hat, that is one I do not have, so we will definitely be snagging one of those. And that is another hat to our collection. Slowly but surely we are knocking out all the free to play hats. This making me the coolest wizard of them all. Let's see what I look like now. Boom. That is a champion. We have one more quest to finish off the video. This is Witch's Potion. Another very easy quest, putting me at magic level 10. We still have a few free to play quests to go here, but we will knock them out. I'm not sure if it's gonna be on this next video or not. We will kind of go from there, like usual. And before we know it, these are all gonna be done. I plan to have all the free to play quests done before I go into members, just so I'm gonna be like, ah, free to play stuff is done. Cool. So that might be something I try to work on in between getting hats for sure. We will kind of see. For now though, thank you for watching my video and I really appreciate it if you've come this far and I hope you have a wonderful day.